Good afternoon, Teacher Ayen. Yes, good afternoon, Vivi. Okay. So here, I think we're done with this one. Wait me a minute, Vivi. Can you hear me well? Yes, can. Very good. So now, I want you to open your camera, Vivi. Yeah. Yeah. Can you please open your camera so that I can see your face? Yeah. Can you open your camera, Vivi? Yeah. Okay, wow, there you are. So I'm happy to see you again. How are you today, Vivi? I am good. Wow, what did you do today? Today, I, mm, I woke up and I, have, uh, I brushed my teeth and uh, I go to have breakfast. Oh, yeah. Good. How's the weather in your place right now, Vivi? It's sunny and warm. That's my favorite weather. Okay. So now, can you see the screen clearly? Yes, I can. Okay, so our lesson for today is in Unit 43 entitled My Holidays. So here, Vivi, I want you to draw lines between the questions and the answers. Yes. Okay, take your time. Shall I have done? Okay, let's check your answer. Do you enjoy going on holiday? Yes, it's great. What do you like enjoy on holiday? That's coffee ice cream. What do you like eating on ho uh, Who do you go on holiday with? That's my grandparents. What do you like doing on holiday? That's playing tennis. Okay. So you got three out of four here, Vivi. So now, tell me about your last holiday. Last holiday is very great. I have, I have, um, I have, uh, I had to travel to Phuket, Iceland. And I go to play and swim there. I eat many seafood. It's great. Great job. Okay, so in reading and writing part to Vivi, the first person in each conversation question or answer turn is not always the same. Sometimes names are reversed. When you finish choosing your answers, you should always quietly read the conversation again to check, to check that it makes sense. So for this one, I want you to read and choose the best answer. You can circle that one, Vivi.
I have gone to jail. Okay. So I want you to answer me using the one that you circled. Number one, did you enjoy your holiday jail? Last year. Okay, so that's yes. Thanks. Where did you go? Mm, to the jungle. Very good. How did you get there? We went by helicopter. Very good. What sports did you do on your holiday? We went swimming. Great. Here are two photos. Wow, they are great. Great job for this one, Vivi. You got four out of five. So now, let's proceed here. There are two pictures. I want you to look at two pictures about Jill's holiday. What differences can you see? First, Vivi, you circle the differences. Then you tell it to me. Okay, you can take your time and please start. Yes. Teacher, I have done. Okay, so now I want you to tell me the differences, Vivi. Yes, in the picture one, I see one, one. In the picture one, I see four birds. Is uh, it's in the tree but in the picture too i see only three birds in the tree in the picture one i see the girl is standing next to the wood the river and takes a photo but in the picture two i can't see the girl in the picture one the monkey on the tree in the tree it's having a the nun uh, having a flower, but in the picture too, I see the monkey had a uh, have a banana. In the picture one, I see the one uh, the boy is climbing the tree, but in the picture two, I can't see him. In the picture one, I see the boat is. Uh, it's brown, but in the picture too, I see the boat is orange. In the picture one, I see one girl is swimming um, on the river, but in the picture, um, in the picture one, I can't see um, the um, anything. But in the picture too, I see a girl is swimming on the river in the river in the picture one uh, in the picture two i see a boy is uh is fishing 
near the um, river, but in the picture two, I can't see him. In the picture one, I see uh, one bat, but in the picture two, I see two bat bat. In the picture one, I see the 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 snake is short but in the picture too i see the snake is long it's the end great job vivia so those are the differences you got a perfect score so now i want you to read fred's story and you write the correct word next to numbers okay so it's about my holiday by Fred Tap. Can you please read and write your answer?
Hello, Vivi. So do you have answers now? Where's your answer? You're right. I am not done. Ah, okay. So take your time. I have done that. Okay. So now let's check your answer. Plain, sunny, pineapple, tablet, and grandma. Very good because you got a perfect score of perfect score of five out of five. So now I want you to read my holiday by Fred Tap loudly. Yes, my name's Fred, and I love going on holiday. For our holiday last year. He, uh, we went to an island. We traveled there by plane. That was exciting too. Mm, it was hot, uh, hot and sunny the, uh, every day on the, the island, but sometimes it, uh, it rained at, uh, a lot at night. The food there was fantastic. We ate a lot of pineapple, pineapples, kiwis, and fish. Oh, uh, and one day, Dad cooked pancakes for us, with, uh, which we had a lemon uh, had with lemon sauce. We went to a long uh, for long walks along the, the beach and on our last day i saw jellyfish mom through the uh, mom through they were scary I, but i loved them i took my tablet and uh, tablet to take photos of everything and play games on a uh, on uh, and I brought back the, uh, some really pretty shells. I gave the best one to my grandma. She loved it. Very good. So thank you for reading that one, Vivi. So now I 
want you to think of five fun things you can do on an island and five fun things you can do on the sea. What is it, Vivi? I'm going to give you an example. Yeah. On the island, we can run. On the beach, we can swim. So what are the five things that we can do in an island and five things that we cannot do? What is it? On an island, I can play with the ball, and run, and take a photo. Take a lot of photos. We had we make a a sand castle. And we can eat on a sand. And in uh, on the sea, and can swim and play with water, water, and I um, um, and I. Okay. I don't know more. Okay, so here are the things that you can do on the island. Can you please read? On the island, run on the sand, play games on the beach, climb coconut tree, look for animals, take photos, swim in a waterfall, go for walk in the jungle, draw picture on the sand. Find different mm, fruit to eat. Mm. Sleep in the sun. Pick uh, flowers. Go fishing. Have a picnic. Go uh, look for shells on the sand. Look at the rock tools. Clam. Uh, clam. Mm. Make sand castle. Read a book. Listen to music. Great job. So how about on the sea? These are the things that you can do on the sea. Can you please read? Can you please read the things that we can do on the sea, Vivi? Mm. On the sea, go for swim, mm, play ball games, catch fish, go sailing, mm, on and go on a boat trip, play on surfboards, go water kinging, go windsurfing. Uh, Swim underwater to look for shells and fish. Jump up and down in the waves. Okay. So that's it. So here now, Vivi, I want you to complete sentences about two dream holidays. Okay. So your you as a student and me as a teacher, you will also complete this one. And you guess, what is the dream holiday of 
teacher AM. So you write your answer here, Vivi. Okay? Yes. I have done teacher. Okay, how about you as a student? Where do you want to travel as a student, Vivi? You write your answer for this one also here. Yeah.
Okay, so very good. You want to go to the beach and teacher AM want to go to the island. We love to travel by plane. We all both love to travel by plane. Love to be with our family. You want to love you on my on your dream holiday, you love to eat see, food and swim. Eat food and swim. Very good, Vivi. So now, Vivi, I want you to answer the questions. What an exciting trip. When did you go on your trip? When did you go on your trip? When did you go on your trip? Hello, Vivi, can you hear me? Okay, so when did you go on your trip, Vivi? I go to the beach. Okay, so here, where did you go? Mm, I go to Nepal. Okay, so here, who did you go there with? I go with my family. Very good. How did you get there? I go there by plane. By plane. Then what did you do first when you got there? What did you do there when you got there? Mm -hmm. I, I go to Sunday. Okay. So which part of the trip was really exciting? Mm, it's swimming. Swimming. Okay. So would you like to go on a trip like that again? Yes. Oh, very good. So here, thank you so much for joining our class today, Vivi. Since we're done, okay, so we will just end here. Do you have any question before we end? No, I don't. Okay, so thank you so much for your time, Vivi. Uh, don't forget to answer your homework. I'm going to send it again to you and I will give another homework. So you can send that one tomorrow before our class. Do you understand? Yeah, do you understand? Yes. Okay, so goodbye, Vivi. Enjoy the rest of your day. See you tomorrow. Bye.